Well, the YMCA of Marquette County will be entering their second summer session program soon. This morning, Ansley Watson is at the Y to tell us more about what these programs are. Good morning, Ansley. Good morning, Vicki. Well, of course, we know the Y offers so many programs for all the kids, the youth, and adults. Their second summer session begins July 31st, so you have just about a week more to register if you'd like to do that. But later in the hour, we will be talking more about some of those programs, which include TRX. Now, TRX is a really a fun program. Actually, we will be showing a little demo, so you probably don't want to miss out on that. But also, we will be talking more on their diabetes prevention program as well, so stay with us. Reporting live, Marquette Ansley Watson, TV. News. All right. Thank you very much, Ansley. We'll catch up with you a little bit later on. Welcome that. back. When it comes to healthy living, there are a lot of programs that you can get involved with to help you along. This morning, Ansley Watson is at the YMCA of Marquette County to learn what programs they've got going on right now. Good morning, Ansley. Vicki, good morning. Well, one of those programs is called a TRX, and we will be showing you how to do that this morning, so don't make fun of me, it's going to be a struggle. But Christina Bennett is joining me this morning, and she's a Healthy Living Director here at the Y. Good morning. Morning. So what are some of those newer sessions coming up that people can register for? Yeah, so program registration is open for members and non-members right now. We have a variety of classes for kids and for adults. Um, for instance, the, our, one of our kids' classes, Just Keep Playing, um, that com combines activities in the Wellness Center, so a lot of strength. Um, components and then the remaining the re remainder of the class is in the is in the pool so activities in the pool so. now TRX you've had this program for a couple of yep. years so it's nothing new new but I think a lot of people don't necessarily know how to do it I mean if you look at them they're really yeah. just you said they're toes they like, like <laughs> <toe straps, laughs> <yep. laughs> so let's demo I'm going to uh, sacrifice my athletic ability here to show how okay. this is done and what is some of the most common moves to work out with on these four? Well, what we're going to do today is a chest press, a push-up. And the great thing about TRX is, like, anybody at any level ability can do TRX. It's just a matter of changing your position to make it more difficult. Uh -huh. So, um, for instance, level one, push-up. So you're staying straight up. Your arms are straight out in front of you. Shoulders are back and down. And another great thing about TRX is it really engages your core. Uh -huh. Um, so arms are straight out in front of you, you're staying straight up and just bending at the elbows, coming down and back up. To make it a little bit harder, you just simply take a step back and again, come on down and back up. And then if you want to, you know, kick it up again, you can either take another step back or you could even try, this is going to throw your balance off a little <laughs> bit. Oh no. <laughs> on one foot, come on down oh. and back up. So three nice. different ways to easily kind of bump it up a little bit or make it easier depending upon what your, your level is. So. It is incredible. And when people take these classes, what are some other options? We don't have to necessarily show them, but what are some other ways you can use these straps? Well, so we just worked our chest. You could also, I mean, just as easily work your upper back and that's just simply, you know, turning around and then, you know, simply like doing a row. Oh, yeah. So explain how these were created again. That story is really interesting. Yeah, it was created by through uh, Navy SEALs looking for a way to get their fitness on while they were, you know, out overseas or what have you. So something that was quick and simple, easy to put up. Um, and these are, you know, again, th these just clip onto these. Um, you can put these literally you anywhere. You can put these anywhere. As long as you have something to hang them from, you can put them anywhere and get a pretty decent workout in. Um, yeah, it's incredible. So if people want to register for Y classes, how would they go about doing they that? They just come on down to the Y. Uh, they can call the Y. They can register online. You can register for TRX. TRX runs with our sessions also. You can also do them, um, pri do private TRX sessions. So another neat thing that we will be talking about more later in the hour is diabetes prevention program. Yep, yep. Give us a little sample about how that program works. Well, that's a year long program. Um, there we meet for the first 16 weeks, weekly, and then bi-weekly, and then monthly. So making small changes for long-term health benefits. So. Perfect. All right, Christine, stay with us. We'll have more details right. later in the hour. Reporting live, Marquette, Ansley Watson, TV6 News. All right, thank you very much, Ansley. That looks like quite the workout out there, and I know we'll be catching up with Ansley a little bit later on, finding out what she does to get healthy. So it's good. The YMCA of Marquette County is gearing up for its second set of summer programs. Ansley joins us again from the Y in Marquette with more details. Good morning again, Ansley. Andrew, good morning. That's right. We're continuing our conversation about some of those summer sessions that are taking place here. Christina Bennett is 
joining me. She's the living director here, living healthy living director mm -hmm. here at the Y. So let's recap on some of those summer sessions that people can sign up for within the next week. Yeah, so summer program, summer number two session is open right now for members and non-members. All you have to do is come on down to the Y and register in person, or you can do that online as well. Is it for, if, what if you're not a member? Can people still be a part of those summer sessions, or would you then become a member and then? Nope, you can, you can be a non-member and register for those programs. Okay, perfect. So, so let's get into this diabetes prevention program. Okay. Great, great program here. I don't think it's very well known out in the public that you guys offer that here at the Y. What does that encompass exactly? So if you are at risk for type 2 diabetes, so if you have a diagnosis of prediabetes, you can participate in this class. And what this is, it's a year-long program. Um, there are 16 weekly sessions, and it goes down to monthly, or I'm sorry, bi-weekly and then monthly maintenance sessions. Um, and it's to help you um, build healthy lifestyle changes so that you can help um, reduce the risk of type 2 diabetes. You're saying there is some work you have to do before you can come into this class a little bit, a little bit of pre-work. What is that? Yeah, so there is a little intake process, um, and there you do have to have a diagnosis of pre-diabetes, which... Um, the criteria for that is um, BMI greater than 25, or you can get a, a blood test from your doctor. So there's three different types of blood tests or uh, pre-diagnosis of gestational diabetes. So a few different ways. There's also a six-question risk assessment quiz you can, kind of you can take as well. So. so those people come to the Y. It's taken right here at the Y. Mm -hmm. What would then people learn when they're in these classes? Just simple steps, simple lifestyle changes they, that they can do. The, the goal of the program, it's an evidence-based program, and this shows that that evidence shows that 7% weight loss plus, you know, eventually you're doing 150 minutes a week of exercise helps prevent, um, helps reduce the risk of type 2 diabetes, so. Is there a certain cost to this at all? Yeah, so the cost of the program, it's generally like $430, but through generous support through UP Health Systems, we're able to offer the class at a greatly reduced rate, so um, $214. And now the Y is able to accept insurance, so you know check with your insurance provider to see if the, you know this class is covered. So the whole cost of the class could be covered. So, have you heard from anybody that's been involved in this classes of how these have helped at all? Yeah, um, we've we've had folks go through this class, um, and that they have met their goals of 150 plus minutes of exercise, okay. making those healthy lifestyle changes, and it's greatly impacted you know not just them but their family making those healthy lifestyle changes. Yeah. Is there anything else you'd like to say about upcoming sessions here at the Y or any other programs that people may not know about that you just want to get out there about the YMCA of Marquette County? Well, I feel like just you know look looked forward to um, you know what we have for the rest of the summer and then even going into the winter. We have some new programs that we're developing for the winter. Or I'm sorry for the, the for fall. the fall. Yeah. Winter will be coming right yeah. after that, so <laughs> people need to look out for that as yeah. well. Ms. Christina, thank you so much for being with us. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Reporting live in Marquette, I'm Ansley Watson, and we'll be back with more of your TV6 Morning News after the break.